Hey everybody, I'm here today to talk to you about putting premium gas in your car and whether or not your car actually needs it. So the short answer is no, your car does not actually need premium gas, but it will benefit from that premium gas. And I'll explain why. So cars that use premium gas have engines that have a higher compression ratio and advanced ignition timing. So the engines that take premium gas uh, have a higher compression compression ratio and advanced ignition timing when being compared to engines that take regular gas. Now, what does that mean? Well, that means that they operate at, with higher performance, basically. So um, they produce a little bit uh, more power and so forth, more, more horsepower, more torque. They run a bit more efficiently. So if you do not put premium gas in your car and it's supposed to uh, take premium gas, if you do not put premium gas in your car, your engine will likely have um, a worse gas mileage and a lower power output. It will not produce as much horsepower or torque uh, as it would if you put premium gas in it. Now what that means is that with the worse gas mileage, when you put regular gas in, your car is going to burn more gas for driving the same distance. Now that means that, let's say that you put premium gas in your engine and you spend $100 on premium gas and you end up driving 100 kilometers. I know these figures are very off, but it's just for the sake of explaining it. So $100 worth of gas, 100 kilometers. If you were to put regular gas in that same engine, you would get reduced gas mileage. So let's say you put regular gas and the equivalent number of liters of regular gas would cost you $80. The reduced gas mileage would only allow you to travel 80 kilometers. So the ratio of gas used versus kilometers traveled is roughly the same and obviously if you were to put regular gas in a car that takes premium gas you would get um, a reduced amount of horsepower and torque so it would it wouldn't drive as well as it would if you were to put premium gas in it so that basically means that no your car does not need premium gas you can put regular gas in your car that says it needs premium gas however it would benefit from um, the premium gas that you put in and when you put regular gas in an engine that requires premium gas not only does it not perform as well as it would with the premium gas but it also will build up carbon and so forth and all of these negative things will end up happening to the engine much faster so your main your maintenance costs that are associated with that engine will be higher if you use regular gas so although you're saving money by putting in regular gas as opposed to premium gas you will have to spend more on the maintenance for the engine so you're gonna spend more money on maintenance and you will make up for that savings um, that saved money that you have uh, received in using the lower quality gas. So basically um, there are negative things that are associated with putting regular gas in a car that requires premium gas but your car does not need it so if you are in a situation where you need to fill up your gas tank and there is only regular gas available and uh, you know you, it says that your engine requires premium gas you can put regular gas in that car and there will be some negative side effects to putting regular gas in it but if you are just doing it once or twice or th once or twice or three times then it's it's really not that bad so your car doesn't need regular gas your car doesn't need premium gas but it would benefit from it so i would highly advise putting premium gas in your car if that is what it recommends and that's all I have for you today. Thanks for watching.